Last time on Clark. Are you fucking serious? Yeah, fucking, I got this a show. Um, I don't know if I can create. If we can get some stimulants, maybe I can get something done. I, I know a guy, so uh, I need everything that you have. Hey, Clark, what's up? What's up, man? You know, no, a lot of, a lot of, a lot, a lot of work's gonna get done tonight. I can tell you that much. He's dead. I told you to stop fucking around with that dope, man. I'm gonna call up this fucking dealer, and I'm gonna say that I'm Tito, and I need more of this coke from I fucking cut off his face and wear like a mask. <laughs> And now, the exciting conclusion of Clark will air in two weeks. Please stay tuned for this special announcement. Hello Clark fans, I'm JC, the actor that plays Clark's manager. And I'm Daniel, director and producer. We hope you've been enjoying our first season of Clark, which will be available on DVD in the spring of 2011. You may notice that Clark is not with us today. That's because he was incarcerated for the possession of narcotics. We, as his friends, wish to declare to the public that we are in no way involved. We would like to take this time to express our opinion about substance abuse and its effects. We do not condone nor partake in any substance abuse behavior. What you're viewing is acted. These substances are props. And the alcohol is actually water. We just wanted to clear that up for our viewers that may be copying the characters from the show. Gonzomentary is a marriage between two words. Gonzo, a style of journalism that is written subjectively and mockumentary a genre of film that is presented like a documentary but is either set up or fictitious. This means that everything that you've been viewing is never not always true sometimes, maybe. It has come to our attention that Clark has been the motivation behind the origin of a cult-like group that ritualistically abuses drugs and has what they call penis parties. These Clarksists, as they call themselves, are in no way affiliated with the cast and crew of Clark. Exodus Films, or any of our sponsors. Drugs and other substances are a danger to your physical and mental health and have a negative effect on our society. We wish to talk more about this uh, after we come back from this break. Welcome back to this special edition of Clark. Daniel, you were once addicted to alcohol. How'd that affect your life? Uh, a lot. Um, you know, it, it, my life was shit. Uh, I was once a director for daytime drama, and uh, I had money and fame and a wife and kids, and the only thing I cared about was alcohol, so my work suffered greatly. It was uh, one of the darkest periods of my life, and uh, here's a clip of one of my shows. Without you. you shouldn't be here, Danielle. You need to go on with your life. I know you think we can't be together, but isn't it wrong that we should only be half alive? Only half of ourselves, only half of something that's half of a whole thing? There are too many risks, Danielle. Too many obstacles to face. Like this wall. But I want to face them with you. 
I love you. So here I am, standing on your rooftop. I've always been standing on your rooftop. And now we're here together, above this city that you sacrificed yourself to save. Isn't it time that someone saved you? You don't understand, do you? <laughs> you don't know shit, you stupid what? bitch! What is it, John? What's keeping us from being together? I guess I should have told you before. I've held it in for so long. Please tell me, John. Please tell me so we can move on from this. Danielle, I will tell you. I will tell you. When the time is right, I will tell you. And when that time is right, you will know. And that time is right now. And I'm going to tell you right now. Danielle, the reason I am so detached is for the following shocking information that I'm about to tell you, which I have kept secret deep inside me for so long. And here it is, Danielle. Here it is. The reason I am so detached is... So as you can see, uh, my work was pretty bad. And uh, James, you used to get high as well, right? I still do, but yeah. yeah. Uh, yes, Daniel. Yeah. And let me tell you, it was awful. I would wake up in the beds of beautiful young women and not remember their names. We would have crazy parties where girls got wild and drugs flowed like a wonderful nourishing river through my house. I've been there, man. Yeah, it was a really dark period in my life. Here's some clips. <laughs> Sorry I didn't go. Um, we're having another one this weekend if you want to go. Yeah, totally. Fucking the sobriety thing sucks. We'll be right back. I love sucking my sister's toes. What's wrong with me? Fuck you! Fucking. 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 Fucking, fucking, fucking shit! Suck my fucking cock! Fucking! What the fuck did you give me Goya cooking wine? Shut the fuck up. Piece of shit. Fucking, 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 fucking piece of shit! Fuck. fucking. I know how to make bombs, asshole. Motherfucker, who are you? You're the sleaziest piece of shit I've ever met. Fuck up. You fucking, fucking piece of shit. Fuck up. Fuck! Welcome back. We hope you found this special episode of Clark informative and educational. We also hope you're enjoying our entire <clears throat> our entire season. It was a lot of fun for us to shoot, and we hope to begin production of season two, and hope our viewers continue to support us. That being said, we would like to ask you to donate to our show so we can bail Clark out to continue production. To do this, please go to www dot exodusfilms.org and click on the, the free Clark donation button on the home page which will link you to PayPal. We're asking our fans please help us reach our goal of $24,000 
before Clark gets sentenced to federal prison on January 22nd. That's, that's today. It's today. We're asking our fans to please give us $24,000 so we can hire a new actor to portray Clark. Or prostitute. Thank you for watching. We've talked a lot about drugs today, and there are many dangers. And we want, uh, it, 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 what? If you want more information on, on drugs, visit your local drug distributor, Tito. He's a, he's a good guy. Oh, dude, let's call him. <laughs> yeah, man, let's go, Tito. Who are we talking to? I'm talking to Daniel the video. Oh, sweet. Daniel. Make sure that my face and my name isn't in it because I'm in the army.